Sorry, I was having a bit of trouble figuring out what was going on with my computer. There we go. Aha! Okay. I'm hoping everyone can hear me. I'm not gonna be around too long, got a bad headache from idiots. That's totally fine. There's my laptop. Everything is finally charged enough that I can actually get started. Yeah, I went to turn on the computer and all I got was the dead battery thing. Very sad. I was like, haha, you thought. Welcome in, Harley Cryptid. Hold on, what was I doing? Haha. So why is this all hunky like that? Okay, it's not supposed to be like that. Did you make a new brace from the dog's side yet? No. No, I have not. And it's not a, it's not a brace or anything. It's, it's an arthritis glove. Where's the end of this fucking... It's like just compression and stuff. He's eaten like three of them now. I got like, I found like a cheap multi-pack. So like I've got like several more pairs, but oh my God. Like at first he was just really into socks, but now he's eating the gloves and I don't know why. Ah, uh, but hello, welcome in, Ray of Swords. Meow to you, to you as well. I'm trying to think of how I want to do the background because I didn't, I didn't pre-make one for today. Got a Tinder notification? The fuck?
TikTok notification. Everything's going to my headphones, so like every time there's a notification, it's loud as fuck. I have designed Anthro Susan Olive twice. So like I have a general idea of how they look, but it's been a while. I just realized I was doing this on the wrong layer. That's fine. That's fine. Again, I just grabbed the wrong layer. Why? Why am I like this? I feel like doing fall. I need a desaturated orange. So how's everybody's day going? on this, the 7th of January. I got gin and grapefruit soda. <laughs> I can't go wrong with autumn. Heck yeah. Wait, did you misspell autumn? Wait, no, it looks the same. I have no idea. It does look the same. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, because I was just staring at it like those look like they're spelled the exact same. I don't understand. Shouldn't it be since it's a season? I have no idea. I think it depends, because sometimes it's a name. Doing good making new outfits for my PNG? Heck yeah. You know what else is a season? When I grate my foot and say it's a parmesan. Ew, that is disgusting. Gross. No, that's not even in the fun way. That's just gross. I didn't like that. Blech. Oh no, what did I do? There we go, that's what I needed. So Susan has a backstory, so I guess I can't make up a dark one. We are not giving Susan a dark backstory. It's not happening. Susan is fine. Susan is semi well adjusted.
Susan was, Susan was well adjusted till the fall of 2029, where she met anti Susan. Susan is a they them. Just to just to clarify for the stream. Yeah, Susan is non-binary. <laughs> Cause she got two beans. Then S Susan, they slash them cause a samurai. I think that's a very nice background. It's very bright orange. Ooh. Welcome to Silent Hill. Oh, sorry for any flashing. Welcome to Silent Susan, a vow they took after killing anti Susan. I. F sure. Now that just looks like it's on fire. That has some, like, fall vibes. What was that? Oh, I hydrate and a treat pando. Okay, very well. And look, I'm actually drinking water today. Yeah. Disgusting. Age of Chaos, Susan. Heck yeah.
have a tendency to make Susan tall and kind of scrawny, but I'm thinking about kind of redesigning them to be more short and stout. So they're more like their actual possum-y self. I'm a little Susan, short and stout. you doing? I'm gonna check and see if I still have some of the old artwork for Susan. I used to draw their face in like a very particular way. And I'm trying to do it from memory, but I can't quite. Have any of those just a different Susan? Hello! Welcome into the stream. Uh, hang on. I'm reading it, trying to figure out how to say it. Barbara Chelsea Howe, welcome in! I was like, that's a lot of letters. How do I break it up? I am little littling for a Susan Doodle that I did at one point. So I can get the face right because this isn't the, this isn't like the first time that I've drawn Anthro Susan it's just been a while since I've done it because I could have sworn I did one right around the time that I did art fight so that there would be an updated reference of them I know it's in here somewhere. Oh, that was a really cool character I didn't get to draw, but I saved the picture of. Eh, I'll do them next year. Okay, those are the ones that I did. Wait, wait, is this it? Hey, I found Anthro Susan! Yee. And this was the more recent Anthro Susan. Wait, let me heart that so if I lose it, I can come back to it. Ooh, give me just a second. I'm gonna pull it up as a reference. I just don't want to show you guys, like, my entire, uh, cell phone history. <laughs> Albums, favorites. Where is it? Where is it? I just saved it. 
Oh, oh, here's... Oh, this one's my favorite one. Here, you guys can... S and I've actually got the color palette attached. Oh, I am so proud of myself for saving that. So this isn't the one that I made for Art Fight. But this is... Uh, this is the one I made way before then. You actually did a commission for me a long time ago? Oh, heck yeah. But yeah, okay, so this is the original Anthro Susan design. I don't remember when I made it. <laughs> but yeah, I was... Uh, I still don't have any set transitional gender for them. Like, they are non-binary. They aren't AFAB. They aren't AMAB. They're just Susan. They do tend to swing more towards, like, flowery. But, like, that's it. <laughs> Why is the thing not there we go there now it's moving yeah it was a, like a really particular way that i drew the face and i like could not remember how i drew it the ideal form for many also can i maybe get y'all's opinion on something i mean sure feel free to like shoot the question out into the chat But also the nose was a heart, and that had to be, like, my favorite feature. Should I dye my hair cyan blue or keep it rose pink? Personally, I'm for whichever color is your favorite, but at the same time, I completely understand being stuck between colors. Also, both, both is good. That is also a very good option. I like them both the same. Getting both together costs a lot more. That's fair. Are you going to a salon to get it done? Or are you doing it at home? Going to a salon? Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, that, that does make a bit of a difference. <laughs> I, I always do mine, like, at home, me, my sister, a pair of cheap gloves, <laughs> like a nice bowl, the little brush. I don't, I don't think I've been to a salon since high school and my dad was like, yeah, no, we can get your hair done professionally. And then it was bright blue. That's the fun though. Yeah. But okay. Yeah. Uh, have you had any, like, either of the colors before? Yep, both? Okay. Um, do you... Did you have a preference between them? Like, your experiences with them? Like, did you have more color when it came to, like... Oh, fuck. Words. Um. I, 
I have an easier time dressing myself when I have red hair color or like an orange hair color than I do when I have blue. Because my red is more neutral for me when in terms of like my closet and stuff like that. Whereas blues tend to clash with everything I'm wearing and I feel really weird about it. to favor cooler colors personally so often do blues greens and purples i'm new to twitch is there a way i can talk out loud i oh um i actually don't know i mean maybe if i had you on the discord but i don't i don't know how that would work Oh, that's that's something I've never had to think about with Twitch. I'm still semi new too, so <laughs> I'm just like <laughs> I don't know how most of this works. Uh, oh, I never put up the doodle dress up information thing. Here, hold on. I need to pin this comment real quick, and then I can send in a link for uh, Discord. So one moment, I need to pin this manually unpin back to notes uh, haha welcome copy paste chat uh, I don't think you can be loud on Twitch unless people have text to speech set up yeah I have no idea how that works uh, as for the hair I like the blue color slightly more but the rose pink fades better I mean, that's definitely something to look, uh, consider. I also just, I have trouble maintaining, like, the nice, uh, vibrant colors. Because, like, when I had my, I think the last time I actually liked the blue in my hair, I had a, like, that blonde split in the front. So it was, like, blonde framing and then bright, vibrant blue, but I had such trouble, like, maintaining the color. It just faded out to kind of like a green. But, like, with reds, it's just, I'm naturally a blonde, so it just kind of, like, fades out to an orange and then stays there. Same. I usually end up in some kind of financial rut, and I have to wait forever between color appointments. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Completely understand. legs too long. Legs. Legs for days. So sorry. Welcome into the Discord, by the way. But yeah, I ate a chip. grow my hair back out to the style I want before I bleach dyed again. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I had to chop most of mine off and then regrow it because I burnt the fuck out of it. It's finally back down to, like, just past my shoulders. select all that. Oh no.
also proud of you for eating the crunchy. It wasn't loud, you're good. Yay! I'm glad it wasn't very loud. But yeah, and hey, I've got actual water today. It's not just soda or coffee. Now they kind of look like a bear. Somebody somewhere has a squeaky toy. <laughs> and they squeaked it so loud. It's so gentle and pleasant to listen to. Aw, oh, thank you. That's very sweet. I'm trying to figure out how to get this to stop looking like a bear. What, why do they look like a bear? <laughs> Y'all are very sweet. Thank you. Taking Susan from twig to dad bod. So I think I know who has the squeaker. I think it is my neighbors. Or at least my dad's neighbors. The dogs just started going absolutely nuts when they heard the kid running around. I know guys, I know, I hear it, I hear it too. We're not gonna go off on them. Please, it's too much. Oh no you don't. I'm not giving Susan the braids in this particular because I think we're gonna play with the hair a little bit with the outfits. I think I'm going through an overhaul of my image right now. Hey, that's fair. It happens. I don't think you guys can hear that, but whatever small child is out in front right now just started screaming. And like my dad's got an upfront camera 
and like it's just a kid running around on a little scooter but oh they sound like they're getting murdered yeah yeah just go in that's why don't check they're still going They'll take a breath and then just start screeching all over again. Oh, there's two of them. Are they just chasing each other? Mm, mm, I hate that they're riding through the front yard. Like, I can't really say much, but lordy. if their parents would try to ask them to keep quieter so as not to disturb the neighbors anymore. It would be nice. It would be. But I, I don't have much faith in that happening. So far, they've kind of just been like the type of parents to like let their kids run around and go nuts. Like, there hasn't been any, like, actual damage so far, and, like, they haven't run in front of a vehicle that I've seen, but it's just... I'll just, like, kind of just deal with it, I guess. As long as I get to sleep. As a parent in my own right, I apologize for the lackluster parenting happening with the children outside your place. I appreciate that, thank you. I mean, it, to be fair, it is just like another reminder that I am not suitable for children. So I'll take it. That wrist is so thin. Why did I draw it so thin like that? Because there's a way for that energy to get out without them being ridiculous at all. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. <laughs> I have done enough babysitting and I have worked in enough daycares to know that there are definitely ways for kids to get their energy out without driving everyone in the vicinity wild. It was called Dance Dance Revolution, and they had so much fun. But also cleaning. If you can get a kid to clean, that's a lot less energy. Their playing is a lot more manageable after that. Oh yeah, yeah, they had like a... They had like a little cycle of like three or four songs that they absolutely loved and they would just play for like hours. And I would occasionally get them to play one of the songs that I liked so that it wasn't just hell. Oh yeah, I'm absolutely terrible at it. But they got to bounce around and like get all of that energy out. And it was great. This hand 
hand is so much bigger than the other one. That's probably why that wrist was so skinny. Question. Yeah, go for it. What is your query? For those here who have tattoos, what advice would you give for maintaining them over time? Lotion? Apply sunscreen of going out into the sun? And... Don't injure the area? Because it's gonna scar like a bitch? <laughs> like, I have tattoos, but I kind of suck at maintaining them. I've just got uh, one, two, three, four little tattoos. They're like maybe two inches for like, well, one of them is like an inch and a half, but each tattoo is like only like two inches. Uh, wear a high factor sun cream if you're in the sun is my main uh, sunscreen when they're supposed to that. I love that everyone's like, sunscreen. <laughs> we all agree, sunscreen. <laughs> We're all in complete agreement. You gotta screen that sun. Oh wait, do I have any? No, I can go through. I need to make sure there's no holes so that I can go through and just reverse it. Excuse me. Oh shit, that's not gonna work. Oh wait, there's a hole. Where's the hole? I feel like that's not like the best question to ask, but still, where's the hole? Somewhere in here is a hole in my line work that I need to fill. What's in the box? Oh my god, is that it? Ha! I found it. Oh no. I did not mean to click that. Okay, okay. I got it. And now I can just invert, go down to this layer. having tattoos. Or I miss getting tattoos. It's actually supposed to be more round.
Christmas cards and written scrumbies on it, which are for some animatics. Heck yeah. For animaniacs. Oh, why am I bringing up animatics? Insulation. Nice. Oh my god, somebody has possum wallpaper. Oh, I missed a bunch of messages from my booster. Her and Pagos are becoming friends. Oh no! I have so many we'd be here all day. I have 14, but the last count was over 20. Oh my lord! So many tattoos! Hell yeah! Hey, no worries. Head to bed. Get some good sleep. Do you ever just look at something you made and just be like, how the fuck did I make that? Like, how did this work? I fucked up, but that's okay. Give it a cowboy hat, hell yeah. Give Susan a cowboy hat? I mean, we can definitely give them a, a cowboy hat. I am not opposed to that in the slightest. I love cowboy hats. I used to have a cowboy hat that I wore to my classes in college. Because I was like, if I'm going to be known for anything, it's going to be because I'm going to be known for, like, a cowboy hat. And I was, like, really excited because I loved the cowboy hat, but I have no idea what's happened to it. It existed, and then it didn't. I think I must have broken it somehow. Oh, I love the... I don't know why I did the teeth like this for Susan. But now Susan just has, like, itty-bitty teeth that do this. Because where I have a bit of an overbite, they have an underbite. It's so awesome. Welcome in, Netherlad! I love this up to me. Heck yeah. Susan is basically my fursona at this point. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, I am doing pretty decent. We are 
doing Susan for today's doodle dress up. Uh, Susan is my opossum mascot. Um, they're not they're not anthro, but I've done anthro designs for them, like this one. This one's the oldest design. I think this was the first anthro version of Susan I ever did, because I was like, I want to uh, make an example that I can do personas because no one was hiring me for personas and I was like I want to get better at this so people you know, I, I want to get better and I'm not gonna really get better if people don't like come and get like personas things anyway but yeah and then like I forgot it existed for the longest time and then I made a second version of Anthro Susan and now we're making a third <laughs> So yes, that is that is what we are doing today. I have three piercings, but I want more. I oh wait, how many do I have? I've got septum. Uh, I've got plugs. Technically, I've got two ear piercings on both sides, but like one pair has just been closed or not closed. I just haven't put anything in it for a long time. And then I used to have two more piercings, but those went away when I had top surgery. So I think I've just technically got the four. I want to do more, but like, it's going to be a little while before I can do that. Okay, one second. I did see a comment or a chat thing pop up. I just want to get this really quick. <laughs> it's like a little scarf. Uh, I definitely intend to commission you for art for my online sewing once I've got expendable money to get because I love your style. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you do. It's a very nice style. Thank you. I very much appreciate that. I love that they're almost entirely purple. I don't know why I made Susan purple, but it's been like the best decision. <laughs> Just like, I don't want them to look like a regular possum. How do I make them not look like a regular possum? Oh, I know. I make them purple. I could have done like a cool ass albino possum. No, I wanted purple. Because purple is a great color. Hell yeah. When I was questioning my gender, my sim took me to get a piercing to help with self exploration. Oh, nice. Heck yeah. hearing the fridge make weird noises in the background it's not creaky at all it's not concerning in the slightest See, that normally works, but I don't like it today. I'll grab this, and then I'll go in with a texture a little bit later. That's cute, little possum. Welcome in, Bethlana16. Yes, we are working on Susan the Opossum. It's, we're, we're kind of playing off their or, original anthro design.
I'll definitely say I'm glad we started doing Doodle Dressa because this has been the best practice for character design that I've ever had. Plus, y'all request some of the weirdest outfits. It's great. Me of the cardboard dolls with the interchangeable outfits. Heck yeah. Yeah, because I think, yeah, at the start of these, they were kind of played off as being kind of like the, uh, the old, like, Adobe Flash games. There's, like, Dress Up Barbie and, like, stuff like that. This 100% started off as a joke, but now it's a thing, and I love it. Barbie.com, but first ask dad or mom. Decided, because I think I'm gonna, I'm definitely gonna pick like one of the outfits, and like usual, like you guys can pick like the other two. Because what usually happens with doodle dress up is I don't. Usually, I just have, like, one or two people, like, uh, interacting and kind of playing. Uh, so I'll tend to pick an outfit, and then, like, chat will tend to pick, like, the other two outfits. Yeah, we can definitely do crop tops. Okay, so is this uh, your first time into a doodle dress up at all? Or have you checked in on one of these before? This is your first time? Okay. Give me one moment. Ah! so far. Okay, I'm going to introduce you to some of the other characters that we've done, so you can get an idea of what we're doing. We've done several <laughs> characters so far. Um, our most recent was a pink oyster. Uh, it's a pink oyster mushroom. Very fun. Very cute. We did uh, like a princess gown. Yeah, uh, kind of a Robin Hood character outfit, and then I wanted to do some lingerie because, of course. Uh, we did this one for that same stream. We had enough time, we actually ended up doing two characters. This is an inky cat mushroom. I don't want to do that. And we did a raving outfit, or like a rave outfit, 
a lot of lace was the prompt for the second one. And then that third thing. And then we've also done a squonk, which is a cryptid that is so ugly it cries. But this is a squonk that's gone to therapy and has overcome their uh, insecurities. They're now super into cosplay and they're a professor. This is the one that we did for Christmas. This is Sexy Krampus. Just lots of fun, honestly. This one's one of my favorites. Uh, this is another one that we did for... Uh, this was the stream right before that. Uh, we did a Sexy Reindeer. He, this is Twink Reindeer. It's so fun. And like, I really, really, really want this Kermit sweat sweater just so much. I want it. <laughs> I don't think it's a thing. Someone somewhere might have made something similar, and if they did, I want it so much. Uh, this is uh, the Loch Ness Monster. And it's just so much fun. I love them. <laughs> Uh, women want me, fish fear me. And this is another uh, holiday themed one. This is the Mary Lloyd, which uh, oh, fuck, I don't remember which country it's from. Uh, someone dresses up a horse skull on a stick. And this is the traditional garb, this right here. They, they dress up a skull on a stick and they visit your house and you have to beat them in a rhyming battle. But if they win, they get to come in and drink all your alcohol. It's so fun. And then we did Chupacabra. It's a Welsh. Welsh! Thank you. Thank you so much. I completely forgot where it was from. Uh, yeah. So, outfits galore. And then, uh, before that, we did a Mothman. The Mothman isn't available on those because, uh, he was, he was the first? Because I was just, I had a stream scheduled, I didn't know what to do, so we just drew Mothman, and then we gave him a bunch of outfits. And that's essentially it. And that's the start of the whole thing. We just had so much fun making a Mothman character and dressing them up. We were like, you know what? let's do this next week and then the next week and and then yeah so that's where we're at that's where we're at right now yeah so once a week we come together we make a character uh we do have a queue on discord for characters that are requested Someone had put in a request for an Anthro Susan, so that is why I am making Susan, even though Susan technically already exists. Oh my god, we have an ice cream man in town? I have no idea if you can hear that, but there's an ice cream truck apparently. Oh, they didn't even come down the cul-de-sac. Oh, that's sad. Well, no, I mean, that's understandable, because, like, there's no, no one down here to get any. I already ha I have, like, ice cream bars in the fridge, so I don't need to go out and run and get any. But, like, I love getting ice cream from ice cream men. It's just so delightful. I was denied it for so long as a kid that every time I hear the ice cream truck, I'm like, ah, I'm an adult. I can do it. But I'm not going to do it. <laughs> uh, my lawyer has advised me not to public disclose the specifics of my relationships between women fish and myself <laughs> ice cream no cream I love ice cream ah I love ice cream too ice cream is so fun okay so I need to do Okay, 
to start working on dinner and then prep for my stream tonight. I hope resolution goes well. Thank you. It was lovely to have you in. I shall probably see you later. Uh, I love ice cream. Augie, what's your favorite ice cream flavor? Uh, mint chocolate chip. I absolutely freaking love it. Other people in my family do not. Uh, which means if I buy a container of it, I know no one else is going to touch it. Uh, I also really like triple chocolate flavors. Like, ah, chocolate is just so good. Women? What? Fish? What? Me? What? Love that. Sup, Pixel? Welcome in! Thank you for the subscription. Holy shit, for eight months? Has it really been eight months? Oh my god, it doesn't feel like it. Sorbet ice cream, especially lemon. Oh, nice. I don't eat a lot of sorbets, but like the ones I've tried have been pretty decent. Cookie do, cook, cookie do, cookie dough is a very good contender for me. Nice. No complaints about cookie dough there. Hold on. Uh, oh, I'm gonna have to erase part of that. erase too much. Oh, hi. This looks like a fursuit character. I mean... You're not too far. Pretty close. Pretty close. I cannot afford a fursuit, so this is the closest I'll get, and that's fine. I mean, technically, I'm partially, I'm part way to having like a fursuit. I've got like one of those really cool Halloween mask things where it's like the bull's head, and it's pretty cool, but like the jaw's kind of busted, so it's sad. Oh my god, why is this thing not? Isn't they lovely? Aren't they beautiful? Here we go. <laughs> Not a hedge. I had just drank some. Oh my god. I saw a fursuit whose face came off and they had a skull face underneath. I want it. <gasps> Oh, you know what I could do? I could create a Susan VTuber. I think that's the closest I'd get to having a fursuit. <laughs> Oh my god. Wrong lover. Oh, but yeah, so Pixel, this is the original Anthro Susan design.
apparently I had it saved in my phone, so that's nice. Because I went looking for the reference I made for Art Fight, and I found that one, but then when I went to like pull it up on the laptop, I had this one saved too, and I was just like very excited. It was so nice. Yeah, we have Aunt Susan. Looks like a hippie lady who wants me to try her tea for my negative energy. That is kind of the vibe I went with for that Susan. Oh my god, I'm so in love. Isn't they love? against a very nice fall background. That's what I see in Susan now. Any grown lady who still wears pigtails and has probably tried or uses mushrooms. I occasionally put my hair in those braids. And I have yet to try mushrooms. I am very sad about that fact. I think it'd be a lot of fun to try them. And once again, I have forgotten to add the coat hangers. She'll need a mushroom collection. Are you a grown lady? No, then I'm still onto something here. Oh, I mean, fair. Okay, so we did have a request for a crop top. Do we know what kind of crop top we were wanting? And I am gonna eat a cookie, but I'm gonna mute my mic so we don't hear me crunching. Oh my God, my mouse disappeared from my screen. Why does it do that? Oh my god, you're just trying to get me on everything. How did you posture check twice? Is there no cooldown on that? Oh my god, I gotta turn on the light anyway, so 
Guys, just because I'm getting up doesn't mean I'm going to give you something. Give me light! Ta-da! I have light. Oh, I don't like that light. Uh, let me turn on this other light. Teddy, you're small. I don't want to trip on you. Oh, that's too bright. Warm, I guess. Okay, I have, I have gotten up. I've done the thing. My posture is somewhat corrected. Ugh. Ich. Ich bin einer Erdkunst. When he saw my portrait, he was like, yeah. But I didn't look as good as that. It's funny how we all discuss that, but never had these little fricassees of Catherine and Ross. Okay. I hear a pup. Yes! There are five. One of them is mine, and the other four are my papa's. I am house-sitting. I have done my part to make sure you're healthy. Okay, I'll accept it. I'm, I will, and here's the hydration. flavor stuff and I don't think I like the flavor that feeling when one of your favorite content creators uploads a new video and you're like thank fuck something to drown out the voices at work <laughs> yeah that's a vibe okay okay uh let me scroll up longer one like one that stops just above the belly button okay one of them is a bastard if you're talking about the dogs then yes absolutely switch to water flavors this year. I let myself have one soda a day. I basically don't drink sodas anymore. But while I'm here, I've just I I bought some packs of soda because they were on sale and I was like, "Fuck it, I'm drinking some soda." Almost all of them are diet though. He's like, "I'm treating myself." Because at uh, the house, I almost exclusively drink water flavor. I have like an absolutely massive water bottle that I like fill to the top and I just give it like a sweet tea flavor or something like that. to eat better but my mom visited and brought just a big bag of homemade candy called Christmas Crack. Oh, I love that stuff. What do we want to do for the bottoms? I have an idea. Heck yeah, go for it. little concerned that one of the Christmas cookies I ate may have been a cinnamon Christmas cookie.
How about a slim fitting denim shorts and leggings tight or something? Heck yeah. Stream audio check, please. Is it not showing up for you? What happened to my keyboard? I know you muted to eat, but the background music is also gone. It's still showing up for me. Hold on. Something wrong with my PC. Oh, yeah, the mic's a little... bit of ways. I tend to put the oh, table across from me because it picks up like all the freaking noise. Sorry, hold on. I'm using my cane to scoot it forward. I'm sorry for the loud noise. Canes. Great for keeping you balanced and for bringing stuff closer. Multifunctional. Trying to convince Al to hold something candy. Oh my gosh. I think that's a cute little outfit. Thank you, Pixel, for gifting a sub. Oh, well, there's the noise. Oh, Pando does react to some of that. Pando, why do you react so weirdly to things?
that's a project I keep forgetting that I also can work on. Is that I can make the, um, the stream pet very DIY. But it involves making like a bunch of animations, so that's gonna be a whole thing. So I need to mark a few of these off the request list on the Discord. Because we've done the Loch Ness Monster and now we're doing Anthro Susan. So I need to update the list. your dad bullying you. Oh yeah. You now have tadpoles next to your name. Or not tadpoles, but frog eggs next to your name. Okay, where's the hole? Is it right here? It looks like it's right here. It was! Oh, I am so lucky. I love it when that happens. <clears throat> okay, so... It's cute. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to fill in the hair.
killed her too much for you. It was disgusting, like. Does this one give me the heebie-jeebies? What? I have no idea. Cryptid spider mommy was fake. They don't even have fleas. Wholesome possum person, stay away. I... I don't know why this is the one that would freak you out. Maybe it's the way I drew the eyes? Is it maybe the background? Like, if I get rid of the background, does that help? Exactly, thank you. They don't even have, like... I think because it looks like someone in a It looks like someone in a suit? It's not the suit that's creepy. It's the idea of someone underneath. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> know what color we wanted the leggings it's a skeleton wearing a suit yeah it's a skeleton totally I could put like little golden stars on them. I never claim to make sense, I'm just here to make problems. That's fair. Also, apparently you're becoming friends with my sister now. Which I think is hilarious. <laughs> she messaged me and she was like, I think I stole one of your friends. <laughs> I went all the people over. Apparently. Because the funny thing, like, when it comes to, like, me and my sister, uh,. She tends to be the one that makes the friends, and then I become friends with her friends, but she doesn't usually become friends with my friends. Like, it's happened, like, on the rare occasion. <laughs> and I guess you happen to be one of them. <laughs> my irresistibly goofy charms. I don't know, I told her she was a weirdo. I- Yeah. Aren't we all? Welcome to the family, I guess. Did not lock that layer at 
I believe my quote was, you and Augie are weird. I like it. <laughs> of course. Of course. I actually really like these leggings, they're cool. Those are definitely leggings that I would probably buy. Sweatshirt, and I want to go. No, my letter is. Ha! Too small. My depression is chronic, so these leggings are iconic. Heck yeah. Your, your Discord name is so terrible. Okay, and then you need to duplicate before I forget. And Goggy and Blur. Oh my gosh, I like that. That's cool. It's very cute. Whatever do you mean? Uh, I, you know exactly what I mean. Terrible, terrible person. Hashtag lots of love. <laughs> Just repping all. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're very much, very much. Okay. Oh, freaking. Yeah, yeah. Here, I'm gonna let you guys uh, think about outfit number two. I'm gonna be right back. I need to take a, uh, a quick break.
Oh, hey. Welcome in, big sister. We're making Anthro Susan. Also, good news. The cookie may have tasted like cinnamon, but I checked the ingredients and it did not. So I get to live another day. Sort of. Unfortunately. Oh, it was an alert from my phone. Okay. Flowy dress with vest, paint speckled overalls. I second the overalls. Who voted for the. So we have two votes for overalls. <laughs> you second the floral dress? Ah, okay, so we... Okay, so then we have two votes for the dress. Or floral? Wait, I said flowy. At least I think it was flowy. Flowy dress with vest. I mean, I can make it floral. I mean, I can do, like, moccasin-themed shoes, but I don't think I'm going to be able to add, like, actual, like... Floral and Chloe, the perfect combo. Heck yeah. I always support florals. Oh, I know. I know. I know. You just have to look around the living room. <laughs> okay, but, like, what kind... What style flowy dress like I know the because they said a vest right okay I actually know I can work with that hold on ah that was supposed to be the eraser Fringe always. Oh my god. This is the vest in your mind. That leather strappy fringe. Hold on, I need to go look. <sighs> you have to put now. Your name will change to Heidi. We're not changing Susan's name to Heidi. Oh, we don't have the uh, chat commands. I have not yet figured those out. <laughs> Every time I try and do like chat stuff and applications, my my laptop tries to destroy itself. It we're working on. We're working on it. I can't even open I can't even open Google Chrome while I'm streaming most of the time. Sometimes it's really nice and it lets me do it, but other times the computer just crashes. <laughs> it's so fun here. It's okay, Augie, you're doing great. Yay! Having so much fun. New computer. 
I think I'm gonna be stealing my sister's old computer. So when I ever get back to the house, there should I should be able to like kind of upgrade. And that should at least handle a little bit better. I appreciate that though, thank you. Oh, I can give them long, fluffy hair. Hold on. Oh, but yeah, so we are doing uh, Susan, the page's mascot, as... I mean, I guess to put it simply... Susan's a persona now. Uh, hold on, where's the reference? This was the original Sus Anthro Susan design. It's very old. We love it. Um, but yeah. Yeah. I completely forgot that I gave them a birthday. Susan has a birthday. <laughs> and I can... I think it's like the day that I first made the possum comic. But I'll have to go and check. Yeah, so furry Susan. Does Susan like pie? Susan's birthday is 314. Oh my god, you're right. Oh, I never thought about that. I always thought March was like later in the year. No, you're right. That is the three. I guess they do. I guess they do like pie. Yeah, pie. I may not be good at math, but Susan is. <laughs> I have now contributed to the stream. Well, thank you. <laughs> I'm trying to decide if I want to do something fun with the skirt or just leave the skirt with skirt. Oh, wait, I can make it do a funny thing over the tail. Haha. <laughs> I have drawn several long flowy skirts over the last couple days, so I feel semi-confident in this. Oh wait, that says I have meow contributed to this. <laughs> I love that. Uh, we love a good pun. Wordplay is the best. Okay, I think this is cute. Heck yeah! <laughs> okay, I can put that back on and pop back over here. Okay, okay. Wait, no, I need to lower the opacity of this. Okay, uh, take it off to a box of syrup. Move it over here. Oh, am I on the right layer? I am on the right layer. Why is that over here? Oh, ah, my opacity on the brush itself.
and she comes in with like built-in fingerless gloves. It's so cool. She has her own, or they have their own built-in accessories. So we should be good. <laughs> I love it when that works out. Oh, sweet. And it's all connected. It's all connected. The circ oh I didn't do the back of their hair. Oh dude, darn it. So close, yet so far. Okay, I think I fixed it. It's the circle of life. I don't know the rest of the lyrics, but that's okay. Oh, and it moved us off. <laughs> oh man, I was so close. So pretty. I want to watch the Simone and Pumbaa spinoff show. Heck yeah. What was that? Oh, I got a Discord notification. Why did I get a Discord notification? Are y'all being spicy in Discord? Here's to those options of server. Oh, welcome in, Rave Swords. Okay, that explains why I got a notification that just said toe beans, but I couldn't figure out what it was. I was just like, why did I get a notification that just says toe beans? And it like disappeared before I could check it. And I was like, uh, you know what? I'm setting it up. This is fine. flaw in my plan. Oh no! Oh no! I only ever saw the chili episode. I'm gonna be honest, 
I don't know if I ever watched it. We've got another welcome. Oh, hi. Welcome in, Baklana. Yeah. No, that's too big. Because there is such a thing as too big. I forgot that was on automatic. color. Sorry, I need to fill that in just a little bit. Oh my god. Yeah, I think that blue would work fine. Just a little bit more vibrant. There we go. We'll go in and put a little tinder box. No, why did it do that? I hate it when it does that. Go dark. Thank you. Oh, by the way, Pixel, I think I got all the editing done for the game that needed to be done. I just... I'm trying to think of if there's anything more that I needed to fix with it. Because I went through and changed a bunch of stuff. And I think I fixed some of the... I'm pretty sure I've solved the save issue. So you'll be, you should be able to like save now. Okay. 
you know, I've come to realize this is my second name in Discord to torment you, lest we forget creepy to be warm. Oh no. Oh no. No no. We don't we don't need to discuss creepy huggy worm. Nope, nope, we don't we don't gotta discuss it. We don't gotta we don't wait we, no, we're good. We're good, we're good. We're good. We're good. Or if it's easy to be able to choose checkpoints. No! No! I don't like the worm. The worm is creepy. I don't want to hug the worm. The small child outside once again has the squeaky toy. I feel like there's a story there. Mm, no, you don't. You don't. It's okay. It's okay. We don't need it. We don't need the story. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. It's all good. It's all good. Why is there anything locked up here? Yeah. In other news... That vest is everything. Oh, heck yeah. Thank you. Why does everyone hate the worm? No, this is not the worm. No, no, no. We don't, we don't like the worm. The worm is, no. No, 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 no. The worm makes me like wildly uncomfortable. No, the worm from Labyrinth is fine. Worm from Labyrinth is fine. Okay, do we do we want to know why I dislike the worm from Adventure Time so much? Do we do we want to know some trauma? Do we want that? Do we really want that? <laughs> okay, so growing up, uh, oh no, it's trauma. It is trauma. It is 100% drama. Welcome in, Sergeant McIntyre. So, I don't know how many other parents did this, but this was something that was especially bad for me. Uh, my birth giver used to, like hold me down and tickle me and force me to laugh and then tell me that I'm enjoying it. And that because I'm laughing, I'm enjoying it and I'm having a fun time. And she did that like throughout my childhood. Um, 
And then when she left a, left me and my little sister with her dad, I had some time, like a couple years where it didn't happen at all. And then as like a 17 year old, I think it was either, yeah, I think it was when I was 17, I had gone back for a visit and as a 17 year old, she, I don't, I don't remember exactly the situation, but she had grabbed me and had me on the floor and was on top of me, tickling me. And it, I don't like it at all. I don't, I don't like it when people make me do things and tell me I like it because I'm laughing when I cannot physically control that. Yeah, yeah. So, so that worm, uh, makes me think of that. And it makes me, like, really, really anxious. And it just, it's, it's one of those things that she did that left a long-term effect that I didn't really understand until I was older, and now I'm just really not, not good with it at all. Yeah. Yeah, so that's, that's a thing that, uh, happened. That, that is why, that is why I do not like the worm. And if I do not laugh, I will cry. <laughs> I think arguably that the, the tickling thing was way worse than when she hit me. I think, I think the tickling thing was worse, overall. Like, the hitting I can deal with. I, I shouldn't have to, but I can deal with it. The, 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 the other thing was psychological. Okay, how does this look with the full color? Oh, that's so pretty! I should add some sparkles to the dress. Yeah, and Pixel, don't don't feel bad about it at all. Uh, I was choosing not to bring it up. Plus, there's literally no possible way you could have known about it. I still can't. Uh, does possum person have a name and do they currently have a job? I may have a suggestion for that only suggestion. So their name is Susan. Uh, Susan the opossum is my page's mascot. They are non-binary. Um, their job is hanging out. I think if Anthro Susan wants a job, they can totally like have like a job. Uh, but like mascot Susan is just like a little possum. This is just their like persona version. Yeah, yeah, we love Susan. Susan is fun. This dress came out super cute. Please fix your remotes. What's wrong with my emotes? What I, what's wrong with them? Is it the lettering? Do I need to make the lettering better? You can barely read that it says hype. I know. I am terrible. How about, how, how about this? next next stream on Wednesday. I don't have anything planned out for that Wednesday. I know that there was a suggestion about doing something on Wednesday, but I don't remember what it is. Or was it f stickers? I think stickers. There was a stickers thing. Oh, right. The Marsh. 
marsh stickers. That was that was uh, Wednesday. Yes. So we can work on stuff for that because you wanted uh, stickers for the Discord. Well, not fuck your ideas. You have good ideas. I just couldn't remember what it was. And that's less on you and more on me and my ter <laughs> terrible shitty memory. Oh, wait, no, I need that on Unicorn. Okay, here we go. Haha, -ha, that's up at number two. Okay, so group. There we go. Okay. <laughs> that does not layer up. Okay, and then those two. Those two. Okay, cool. Uh, I don't think we have a clear room lined up, but I can do like a sexy outfit. It's fine. Uh, oh no, I mean screw my ideas to fix the emotes so I can use them abroad. Ab abroad? Abroad where? But also, yes, uh, that is Mothman holding a heart. It's so much fun. Lamp. Yes. Yes! <laughs> we love Mothman. I want a button that says I stand Mothman. I mean, if you remind me during the stream, then probably we can make one. I just, I tend to forget. <laughs> I have a sticker somewhere that says Mothman believes in me. Aww, that's adorable. I have a backpack one as uh, emojis here. I do have no grapes. Did I seriously t name that one no grapes? Why did I name that no grapes? I'm in this. Yeah! I love how we went from like Among Us art games to now it's just dress up art games. Yeah. I do want to do the Among Us art game again at some point because I had a lot of fun. It definitely felt like a predecessor to this one because we were dressing up the different Among Us ones. I miss the Among Us game but not the time period. Oh god no. I don't, I don't miss the time. I miss the game itself and I miss having fun with everybody like dressing up the characters. Because the Among Us art game that we did is how we got, uh, Thick Pikachu. <laughs> Which is my most used emoji. Among Us game we were prior to playing, we gotta suggest doodle outfits for- Yeah, yeah. Because- oh wait, hold on, I can like, draw an example. Wait, what did I just- whoops. So the Among Us game is we would have, I would have like a pre-drawn spaceship and I can draw this almost entirely from memory. I drew it so many times. And what we would do is we would have, uh, I pre-drew blank Among Us characters. And there would be like events in some spots with like some tentacles popping out. And what we would do is like everyone in chat would design different outfits and character styles for the uh, for the characters. So there was one where we did a theme where it was like just Pokemon, and we had one where it was just Disney, and we I think there was an anime one. It was so much fun. It was when I first started like streaming and stuff. And like I didn't have like a set thing to stream every time. So I was like, you know what? Everyone's playing Among Us. I c I don't have the setup to actually play Among Us, but I do have art programs and I can do a game. <laughs> so 
So I was like designing characters in there with everybody. Which is essentially what we're doing now. <laughs> Except now it's just like one character per stream. And we do it like every Saturday and it's so great. By the way, did you know Ussi is the word of the year for 2022? Of course it is. Of course it is. <laughs> oh wait, I need to be on the blank layer. Where's the... There it is. Okay. Why is it being weird? Okay, there we go. Also, I named my Among Us in Scarlet Among Us. <laughs> what? No, that is fantastic. I love that. I'm... I am so glad that's a thing. It's like my favorite fucking thing. Yeah, there's a tweet about it. Let me find it. Yes. Oh, absolutely. Hold on, hold on. I need to click that. I need to click that. One second. Oh. Oh, my screen was so bright for a second. 2022 word of the year is dash ussy. I love this. Hold on. Hyatt Regency Denver at Colorado Convention Center, Center, January 6th. The American Dialect Society in its 33rd annual Words of the Year vote selected the suffix ussy as the word of the year for, two, for 2022. More than 200 attendees took part in the deliberations and vote and join in both in person and virtually in a hybrid event hosted in conjunction with the Linguistics or Linguistics Society of America's annual meeting. I love it. I love it so much. Oh my god. Wait, I need... I don't know if Aurora's still here, but that is fantastic. I'm gonna have to tell her about that later. Oh yeah, that's fantastic. I I am still frustrated that I did not make the Krampusy joke for for the holiday post. Oh, that would have pissed that one person off so bad. Cause there's that one person that was so mad that I didn't uh, trigger warning my sexy Krampus post with. Yeah, yeah. Someone was super mad that I didn't uh, tw that post as ace phobic because it was a sexy Krampus. Oh, I was, oh, I, I absolutely love, love the Krampus. Yeah, yeah, no, someone actually did that. It was ridiculous. Ah, I thought I was supposed to be selecting. There was, it wasn't even the first post of mine that they had been commenting that on. I, I told him to fuck off. <laughs> like that was basically my comment. I just told him to fuck off. And they left, like, a whole paragraph and a half about how they need to hear a reasonable explanation as to why this page is being acephobic or they're going on a block list. And I told him, cool, put me on it. I don't care. Put me on the block list. I was like, if, if, you're, if you've been here for this long commenting crap like this, and you've managed to skip the entire fact that I'm ace. That's on you. That is on you. <laughs> I'm an ace person. I find that incredibly silly. Yes. Get off the internet. What? A rampant homosexual and or the, the snitch. Huh? Oh, I think I missed something. I don't know what that's in response to. I also don't know if that's a joke. Or do I want to skip? 
skip all that and just give them a carter because mix and match is my favorite thing This gender chart is racial monogamous white male, and that's all that's vanilla about me. But that person sounds like they were just reaching to be offended by something. Oh, definitely. And it's like some people are just like that. And I'm like, I don't get it. But <laughs> apparently, I was their chosen uh, chosen page for the day. They spun the wheel of bullshit, and they landed on me. My visit is leg warmers. Mm. I don't think I want to add leg warmers to this one, actually. I think I want to have like one outfit where they like show off their feet because I, I like the way that part of it looks. I'm trying to be the. Oh no, we were talking about the person that was saying I was ace phobic for drawing a sexy Krampus, and then they called me a pick me. It sounds like they hit the fuck around and find out button. Yeah, yeah. It was super weird, but it happened, and I was like, okay. So we were going with the pants after I hit the sentiments. Oh, okay, no worries. <laughs> I'm putting stars on their knees because I think it's cool. We did a whole 80s themed workout with a neon light match. Oh, yeah, Patlana, were you? I don't know if you were there for the Inky Cat Mushroom. Okay, I'm gonna pop over to the mushroom real quick. We did leg warmers! Uh, this was last Saturday. You shoot it on the stream? Oh, I did, yes, okay. Forgot about it, sorry. It's bright. Yes, it is. It's so bright. There we go. I love a comfy outfit. It's all good. We're all on that <laughs> on that last brain cell. I don't think I have any more. I've just got the one and then I'm out of stock. Oh, I was on syrup. Okay, do I need to make syrup thicker? Yes, the answer is yes. Always gotta make it thicker. I'm loaning my brain cell to someone else. You guys have a brain cell. My brain CPU is literally a Dorito. <laughs> ah, wait, I wanted that pointy. There we go. Ugh, I miss being in an area where sweater weather was actually a thing.
I haven't been able to wear a sweater for like two years. And I mean like actually wear a sweater, not like put it on and then take it off 20 minutes later. BRB, you gonna switch the words up? Heck yeah, burps. Do hoodies count as sweaters? I don't think they do. pretty cute too when they're not being assholes bright pink, one bright blue. Heck yeah. But you boys are up and the girls are flying around. I stand for all birds. Oh yeah. Ugh, I can't wait to be back at the house with the babies. Every time I look at the Discord, that name is gonna throw me for a loop. One of them is even an angry lemon. Heck yeah. Blurp. Heck yeah. Doing some audio editing. Your name, Pixel. Yours. have to say it. It's terrible. I'm not saying it. I'm throwing in the braids because I think it's fun. My angry lemon has fashionable orange pants. Nice. Okay, so I need to make some automatic. Oh, sweet. No holes to close up. Oh, that is very white. That's okay, I'll fix it. First of all, gray. And I'll go and fix it. I don't remember the white one or the other smaller white one that looks like a different type of bird. Oh, 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 birds. <gasps> birds? <gasps> oh my god, birds! Oh, if you're not part of the Discord, you're missing out. There's some birds. Oh, finches. Is that a zebra finch? It's very white. Oh my god, babies. Babies, babies, babies. Oh, you put the same sticker. Okay. 
There we go. Oh my god. His name is Petey. I love Petey. I just accidentally turned my phone off. Why did I do that? I need the stream open so I can listen to the audio. Okay. The Budgies and Django, Boba and Din, the other two are Zam and Aura. Aura? My brain wants to go Aurora. So here we are. Okay. I know the first, uh, Din is white with a blue butt. Aww. I know the rose by name and personality, not color. Boba so photogenic, the little head killed. I love the weird nautical blue and gold. It's so nice. Okay, Buzz. Was, was all that noise necessary, my dude? Well, well, you look okay. I don't want peace. I want problems, always. F I mean, sure. stitching to be gold uh, because I'm weird ah okay uh, wait no I want to switch brushes I want to go to tinderbox I want to drop tinderbox and I want to do this
wish that there was more of these like kind of knitted sweaters that would fit me. Because they look so nice and comfy, but all the ones I can find are super small. And sad. that was on automatic. Oh, whoops. Son of a biscuit eater. a little bit darker. Ooh, do I even want to keep that? Oh wait, haha, -ha. I'm so smart. I can just go in and like clean up the edges. Sometimes everything works out. Sometimes it doesn't, but it's still okay. Uh, okay. Oh, I love it. I need that hair to be a little bit darker, though. I love it. I I may or may not have definitely given them my color palette. But it fits and it's pretty. I did base the design off of an actual blue sweater I have. So, haha. <laughs> to be fair, I think you could probably get like a nice gray sweater and then, uh, like, 
do like an ombre dye in like black because I know Riot makes dyes and stuff and then you can get like these little circular leather patches that people put on their uh, suit jackets and put those on the elbows which might be a little less effort than uh, crocheting by just the littlest bit <laughs> and that's them wearing all of them at once. Okay. So you've got outfit number one. I like these leggings though. And I got outfit number two, which is just really pretty. Alright, and then we got this one, which is also really pretty. I really, really like the pants on this one. I, I wish I knew how to make pants. <laughs> but I can't sew for shit. And wow, for once this actually took like the whole stream time. Okay, canvas information. How long did this take? Two hours and 47 minutes. Which we did start the stream late. Because someone unplugged the laptop. Uh, let's see. I don't think we can like look at the time lapse replay real quick. So if anyone missed an outfit, I uh, here you go. You can watch it being made. I do think adding in like the custom backgrounds for each character was a starting to do that is a nice touch because while I did like the uniformity of having like the same background for uh, doodle dress up I think overall it's a lot nicer to scroll through and look at the different designs when they've each got their own unique backdrop that matches the character Just that long waiting of purple. It doesn't add that much time either. No, it really doesn't. Doodle dress up Marshall. Oh my god. Oh my. I mean, yeah, I technically do need to make like an actual character page for them. So I should. And I should definitely do one for the frogs too. I just. I don't know. Marsh Mommy's just definitely not one that you're gonna wanna fuck around with. <laughs> she got all them eyeballs. We're not doodle dressing up the alligator. Oh my god. Oh look, and then this is me explaining Among Us. I love that that's going to be a part of this time lapse forever. Like, that's, that's so great. Don't tell me how to live my life. If you want to doodle dress up the alligator in your own time, you can absolutely doodle dress up the alligator in your own time. I will not stop you. Yes, we are watching a replay. If you want, I can actually start over from the beginning. It takes like, maybe like two minutes to get through. Yes, we are towards the end of stream. Because we completed all the outfits. Here, let me go back to the beginning. Ta-da! 
Yes. And then... <sighs> made, like, a whole background for Suzanne. I meant hitting up Marsh Mommy to be their Marsh. Oh my god. Absolutely not. Ridiculous. Yeah, we actually finished, like, on time instead of, like, super duper early this time. I mean, ever this far. Like, nearly three hours. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The last couple uh, doodle dress ups have been, like, almost four or five hours. Because, like, I will finish a character maybe two hours in and then I have to like oh no not a posture check and then like I'll reach the end and it'll be like done super duper early and I'll be like do we want to do another character is that something that we want to do do we want to invest in another character and then everyone is always like, you like yes and I'm like cool and then we do another character and it goes for like an extra hour but today we actually, we actually did this in the allotted amount of time. I think it's because I was paying so much attention to the details on like actually designing Susan themselves. Cause I'm way more invested. Can always do extra outfits also. No, I want to keep it limited to just three outfits per character. Cause there's only so many outfits I can fit on a screen. And I've found that three tends to be like the maximum on what I can do for like the images that have them spread across. So you'll have them uh, without the outfits, so just plain character, and then uh, outfit one, two, and three next to them. Susan is wonderful. Have folks here in your cha tra cha 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 <laughs> channel trailer thingy? Uh, I don't, oh, I don't know. Do I have that saved on my laptop? I might have that saved on my laptop. I don't know. Ooh, let me check. Uh, let's see. Let me go to videos. Um, scroll. I have so many videos from the marsh. Holy crap, that's a lot. Flash warning. Ooh, I do. Ooh, I could do that. Yes. Hold on, I don't think this will bring up audio, but give me just a moment, and let me see if I can bring up, well actually you might hear audio if it's coming from the laptop itself. Let me see, can I, because I might be able to, I would have to like, toss the file around a few places, but I should be able to get it onto the, the laptop I stream from. Where is it? seconds oh 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 no go back to the beginning there we go. and I don't know if the audio will play but here we go here we go <laughs> that took forever to do just Susan going across Oh my gosh. Yeah, and then there's there's the Marsh Mommy who shows up in the video game. They were so cool. No, you guys, back off. Yeah, that would be Little Old Man. That would be Buzz. Um, the dogs love to bully him. And by bully, I mean walk up to him and be super affectionate. And he hates it. He's so mad about it. <laughs> Susan! <laughs> but yeah, little old man is grouchy. He just wants to be left alone. But everybody wants to love him and be all up in his face. I can help you configure the scene after stream if you want help. Just DM me on Discord. Oh, maybe. Cause I, cause I don't think I have it saved on this computer. Have it view is oh, it's not pinned to the top of my. It's the is it? I know it's uh, 
it's the channel trailer that shows up on YouTube, on Twitch, and I have it pinned to the top of my Facebook, because Facebook allows that. Facebook was like, you can pin things now, and I was like, heck yes, I'm pinning the channel trailer. Oh, oh, how far back do I need to scroll? Oh, I don't have to scroll back very far. I can pin this. Thank you for the reminder. I have it pinned now. It is pinned. Yay! Okay, so that is somewhere up here. Yay, pinning. Helping. Yay! Because <laughs> I just found out recently that you can pin stuff on Instagram, too. And I was like, oh my gosh. So I pinned, like, the, the video for the marsh and then the comic that I did when I had to make a new page. Where it's like, welcome to the new page. And it's like, what happened to your original? It got suspended. Because I'm still having people, like, pop up going, where did you go? I was following you, and then you disappeared. And I was like, it's a... I got suspended. I got in trouble, and they didn't tell me why. And it's so much fun. Aw, oh, thank you for the bits. You're not making good stuff on it. Yes, you can! It's so cool. I don't know if it's an everybody thing, or if it's like, oh, like, slow rolling out. Uh, we need a loop of Marsh Mommy. Try not to breathe. Oh, no. Do you remember the sleepy rainy Susan that says take a moment to breathe? That oh, that would actually be really cool. Super sucks that happened. Oh, I know. I'm up to I'm back up to like 652 followers on Instagram though, which is still like 19.5k <laughs> thousand away from where I was, but it's okay. Rebuilding is slow, but rebuilding is happening. Yeah, I was really sad because, like, uh, the, the Instagram was, like, the most successful page that I had. And then Instagram was like, hey, you know how you're having, like, a really fun time and you're doing really well? And, like, you've got a great following and everybody's really, really nice? Um, fuck you. <laughs> it was terrible. It does remove the bloat followers that don't interact with that at least. Yeah, but I lost like everyone who was like super nice. And I, I suck at remembering names. So like I reached out to those I could remember. And then I'm slowly finding everybody else. Uh, let's see. Uh, okay, who's currently live? Because uh, I think... Saying I'm not nice, you're right. Oh my, no, you're nice. You're nice, it's okay. I still love you. Okay, so thanks for watching until next time. Uh, I am gonna raid out. I am looking to see who's currently live. Uh, the video, I'm gonna have to try and scoot over to this. Kermit? Yes, Kermit. Kermit is the voice I tend to do when I'm being sarcastic or trying to be funny, but um, I do it a lot. <laughs> I usually don't know I'm doing it until someone mentions it, and then it's like, ha ha, Kermit? I'm like, oh god, no. I could have, I could have had any kind of funny voice, but now I'm just Kermit. <laughs> okay, so we have, uh, let's see. See, Vodka Sunny D is playing Fran Bo Fran Bo, and then uh, Dice and Autism is doing Dungeons and Dragons. And those are currently the only two live that are showing up for me. Bye, peeps. Uh, we don't currently have a name. Uh, at least not one that I'm aware of. Fran Bo, yes. I made an evil Kermit the Frog for a D&D &D campaign. Chaos ensued. <laughs> Heck yeah. See you later, folks. Bye-bye, Barbara. Okay. Let me try and spell this correctly. Vodka. Sunny. Vodka. Vodka. Nostack is also live with XCOM 2. Ooh, I wonder if I could... Hold on. Ah, there's typing happening.
<laughs> yes, it was very nice to have everybody in. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I will be posting Susan on the socials in a little bit. Um, they'll be getting they'll be getting posted to uh, all the online social, and then they'll also be getting posted to Discord. There's a channel specific to Doodle Dress Up. So if you wanted to see any of the ones that we've done in the past, that is also where you can go. Thank you for joining. Okay, or texting. Ooh, I will go and check those guys out here in a little bit. Uh, here, but we are gonna go ahead and raid Vodka Sunny D. Uh, and then I'm gonna go check out those other channels to see what they post. Will the raid work? The raid worked! Sometimes it doesn't. <laughs> Do 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 Okay, and then right now. Off we go. Wow. 